I wake up in the morning and thank God Because I know that He blessed me I know that He blessed me I'm in my ride with my 45 Hoping nobody out here test me And you can brag about the money you got My homeboy that don't impress me Cause I don't need drama in my life Every day I'm trying to live in stress free Yeah, I'm stress free So stress dog is not an issue I wake up in the morning and thank God Because I know that he blessed me I know that he blessed me I'm in my ride with my 45 Hoping nobody out here test me And you can brag about the money you got My homeboy that don't impress me Cause I don't need drama in my life Every day I'm trying to live in stress free Yeah, stress free Change like a cartoon's clothes, okay. but I was immature then. Yeah. Now I'm a mature man. Grow up, I'm focused. Yeah, my group broke up, but I be feeling like the air room felt. You know, so what? Still doing shows, except now I'm touring dolo. Still fly, see that country. Boy in polo, heater on my hip like the boy of Pogo. Reaper on my heels like the Jordan logo. Talk by me, it ain't about no money, sure. J, ignore me. He coming to my funeral, you ain't. Call me ugly, go ahead, judge me You ain't got to like me, I know that God loves I wake up in the morning and thank God Because I know that he blessed me I know that he blessed me I'm in my ride with my 45 Hoping nobody out here test me And you can brag about the money you got My homeboy that don't impress me Cause I don't need drama in my life I'm back every day I wake up, gotta get my cake up, trying to put on for my city like makeup, and every night I go out, man you know I show out, my money talk for me and say bro nigga shut your mouth, in every car I hop in, I probably got YouTube, Natty192 here, back again once again, and today, people, today, we are back for episode number three, episode Trace. 
I don't even know if that's Spanish or not, but <laughs> episode number three of our Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. If you don't know what a Nuzlocke is, the rules are in the description. And the randomizer portion, of course, just means that everything in the game, Pokemon-wise, for the most part, I guess, uh, wild Pokemon, instead of Pokemon, she's like that, has been randomized and shook it up, so it's not the same what it normally is. Now, what you guys just saw before we actually started the episode was called a grinding montage. I figured I'd go ahead and go talk about that in case some of you guys have never seen one before. Basically, what that is, is, um... Because it's a Nuzlocke, we do grinding. We do grinding so that we don't get our ass handed to us. And we get leveled up and shit like that. But at the same time, because it's a Nuzlocke and because everybody and their mother is suspicious over Pokemon. Oh my god, such a travesty. Um, people want to see uh, YouTubers grind. So what happens is, you know, you just speed it up a little bit, throw some music to it. It's just to ensure that... I can legitimately say that I didn't lose any Pokemon off screen, no Pokemon fainted, and I'm just bullshitting trying to pull a fast one on you guys, pull the wool over your eyes. So that's basically all that was. That'll be on most episodes. Whenever we do any grinding, it'll be there. So yeah, but of course, any music that's used in the grinding montage will be linked in the description as well. But let's see the fruits of our grinding. As you can see right here, Megatron, our Mega Megatron, Megatron, our Metang is level 13 right now. And his moveset is still the exact same. He did not level up. Well, he, didn't, he leveled up, but he did not learn anything new at all. Because he doesn't learn anything until like level 20 or some shit. Then we have Soul the Salamence. His moveset didn't change from when we caught him either. I don't think he learned anything uh, either. Or it's a she, actually. But yeah, nice moveset. Bite and headbutt, really all we got. And then last but not least, we have Ohos the Masquerade, who, again, didn't learn anything at all. But they're they're all leveled up. They're all leveled up. Yay, yeah, it's happiness. Uh, what I decided to do was make the level limit. 15. I think that's what we're gonna do as we go through the game. We're gonna set a level limit of whatever the next gym leader is, like whatever the next gym leader's ace is. I think uh, our first gym leader, Roxanne, her, which by the way, we're heading over there right now to whoop her fucking ass. But um, yeah, I think her, I think she's a nose pass. I think that's her ace or some shit like that. I think her ace is level 15. If it's not, then uh, you can blame Num Nexus because I was in a Skype call with him and I asked him what's her ace's level, and he's like it's 15 in, in Emerald. So yeah, blame him. But yeah, that's what I'm gonna try and do so that uh, people don't get all upset over being over leveled and yada yada yada. Find something more relevant, relevant. Find something more irrelevant to complain about, please. But our first encounter for what is this, Petalburg Woods? It's a skip plume. What is this nonsense? No, I don't even have any. Po I don't even have fucking pokeballs. Damn it! I don't even have any fucking pokeballs. Take down. I'm not even mad about that. I'm not even mad, man. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad. But you know what? I am gonna go get some pokeballs because I like to be prepared like that. I like to be prepared like that. So let's go in here and uh, hit up DC Pokemon City and shit like that. But yeah, the goal for today's episode is to at least get our first gym badge. I know a lot of you guys were saying that you want the episodes to be longer. Make them longer, Nappy. Make them longer. Make them longer, bro. Good. Make them longer. And um, normally I would, but I think for for this series I'm gonna try and stick to like less than 30 minutes. Uh, call it an experiment if you want. But at the same time, it's it's a lot less. It takes a lot less time to render and upload and yada yada yada, etc. 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 You know, everything's just easier when it, when the videos are shorter. So I think that's what we're gonna do. And plus, on top of that, um, putting in fucking work over there on Lumio Station. Oh, well, why can't I? Oh, we can't get a fucking memo swine yet. Anyways, I was gonna say, why couldn't I have gotten that? Oh God. Hmm. What a one to be found. Ugh. Huh, hello, have you seen any Pokemon called Shroomish around here? I really love that Pokemon. Oh god. I was gonna ambush you, but you had to dwaddle, dawdle in Petalburg Woods forever, didn't you? I got sick of waiting, so here I am. You, Devon researchers, hand over those papers. Is he illegal? You're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? You gotta help me, please. I think that's his voice. Huh? What do you think you're doing? What are you gonna reject him? No one who crosses Team Aqua gets any mercy, not even a kid! Come on and battle me! I like how in the Pokemon world, that is their way to solve any dispute is with a Pokemon battle. Period. That's how they get shit done. Like, nobody has a fist fight, nobody uh, uh, pulls out a weapon on anybody. It's just straight up just, oh, let's have a Pokemon battle! Yeah! It's like Pokemon are their weapons. You're kidding me, you're tough! Nigga, please. Ah, you've got some nerve meddling with Team Aqua. Come on and battle me again. I wish I could say that, but I'm not a Pokemon. Shit. 
And hey, we of Team Aqua are also after something in Rustboro. I'll let you go today. Why do you say that? <laughs> that was awfully close. Thanks to you, he didn't rob me of these important papers. I know, I'll give you a great ball as my thanks. Yeah, give me that shit, bitch. Fuck off. Didn't that Team Aqua Thug say they were after something in Rustboro, too? Oh, oh, oh god, it's a crisis. I can't be wasting time. Yeah, get the fuck out the way, bitch. Waste my goddamn time. You wanna tell me about ledges? Don't tell me about ledges. Nobody gives a fuck about ledges. Ah, Swablu. Is Swablu third gen? Yeah, Swablu third gen. Alteria. Whack ass Alteria. A lot of people disagree with me when I say Alteria should get a Mega Evo. I say that just because it's so weak. Like, for a dragon? Like, Alteria, what the hell are you doing, yo? What the hell is you doing? I don't know, it's just me, though. That's just me, nigga. That's just me. Ah, oh, fuck off. Oh, a wild Vaporeon! What? What? I would love to do that. I would love to do that. Fuck the Togepi. I'm trying not to battle everybody, because I know we're going to have some trainers up here that we got to fight. And, uh, how many don't play that? Oh, Team 09. Thank you. What is that? I don't even know what that is. I just ran past that shit. Having the speed up button is so, like... Oh, God. It's so... Oh, we got orange berries. Uh, 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 excuse me. Oh, it's a bullet seed. Uh, excuse me. We have six orange berries? Give. You can have one. Nope, nope. Nope, nope. You can have one. Give. You can have that. And who's got the potion? I have the potion. I have a potion! There we go. Okay. And wasn't there some shit up here or something? Yeah. Yeah, 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 son. But yeah, I think that's gonna be the uh, the notion that we're gonna go with is that we're gonna try and keep episodes like 25 to 30 minutes long. I was gonna say, I thought there was a secret item up here. It's it's crazy how much stupid shit that you remember. Stuff that does not even matter. Stuff that does not even matter at all. And I just remember that. That's not gonna help me out in life. That's gonna help me out in Pokemon. But still. Anyways, but yeah, we're gonna try and keep them around that time. But we're so over leveled right now. I was just going off of Roxanne. We're just wrecking house on everything in our path. <laughs> It's not even funny. But I figured in the last episode, uh, we started the question of the day thing with uh, the personal questions to get to know each other better. <laughs> and a lot of you guys are a bunch of bitches. <laughs> just fucking around. Uh, oh, God, effects more, really? A lot of y'all niggas is a bunch of bitches. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, last episode's uh, question of the day was all about uh, like your biggest fears and whatnot. Oh, we're still asleep. Let's, let's get Ohos in action here. About your biggest fears and whatnot, and a lot of you guys share the same fear as me with uh, spiders and snakes and creepy crawlies and shit like that. A lot of you guys, a um, surprising number of people, um, were talking about they don't want to die alone. And I was like, what? Like, I like, death is not really something that I think about. So maybe it's, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm lucky because of that? I'm not trying to say, like, those of you who do think about death are unlucky or anything like that. It's just, I've never really, like, thought about it. Like... I've never really thought about, like, how I'm gonna die, and, like, is it gonna be scary, or should I be afraid of it? I don't know, I, I just, I guess I view death as, like, a part of life, and it's going to happen eventually. And I feel like I should stop talking about death right now, because it's really kind of morbid. But anyways, <laughs> a lot of you guys had a lot of, a, um, a varying different, uh, uh, fears that you have, but today's episode, I figured that we could branch out to something a little more, um prepubescent if you want to say that. <laughs> I was I was gonna talk about um, my first fight um, I know I did this in I know I get the quick claw here too don't I don't I get the quick claw somewhere cutters house so I get cut here uh, yeah we get cut here Yee. I'm pretty sure don't you get quick claw here or something like that and I would gladly put that on my med tang or somebody I don't remember where we get it though no 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 I'm gonna do a quick run through and see if I can find it. I feel like this is not it though. Wait, let me talk to little runt. Let me talk to the runt. Premier ball. Wow. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Give me the quick claw. Fuck the books. Who gives me the quick claw? I know I get the quick claw in this fucking city. And I know I get the experience share here too. <sighs> Where is it at? Who has it? Who has the quick claw? Fuck your Pikachu, nigga. Fuck your Pikachu. Anyways, yeah, I know I mentioned this in the uh, Platinum Egglock, and I feel like since we're doing the personal questions, just get ready for me to mention the Platinum Egglock a lot, because it's just, you know, that's how it be and whatnot. But yeah, I don't remember if this was the exact same... Do I get it at the trainer school? 
I don't know if this is the exact same uh, answer that I gave on that one, but this is what comes to mind right now as I'm recording this. Um, my first fight, I remember, it wasn't even really like a fight. Oh wow, tell him words? Let's tell him... Um, I think he said we're supposed to make her laugh. Fart! Fart! Wald is one serious child. Okay, if she's a serious child, then let's let's uh uh let's give her She's so serious. Is one serious child! Okay, well you know what? Let's just give her the word Serious. How's that? Cause this shit is serious right now. Fuck Walda. How's that? Fuck Walda. She's gonna die. She's determined to be sick. Fuck Walda. Anyways, uh, yeah, uh, I was gonna talk about the first fight, and, um, I don't remember if this is the first, the, the same answer that I gave in that one, but really, oh god, just give me the quick claw. <gasps> there we go, nigga, we got the quick claw, nigga. Okay, so when the orange berry pops, we'll put that on. But yeah, um, my first fight wasn't even really, like, a fight, per se. Really, all it was, was, uh, I remember... I was sitting in a seat on the bus. This was in like eighth grade, seventh or eighth grade, something like that. I remember it was during middle school. We are not leaving with the right person right now. Let's go out to Ohos. Ohos, I feel like since we only know Bubble, like I want to use the water type moves on him, but if they use a rock type on her, she's just gonna get crushed. And that, that really saddens me because I really don't want to lose anybody this early in the game. But um. I remember I was on the bus, and uh, I was just chilling there, sitting, and there was this kid a couple seats behind me in the last seat on the bus, and like he reached up above the back window of the bus, and like took his hand, and like wiped dust off, and he was like making comments about it, and I said, I don't even remember what I said, I said some shit like, that's stupid, or something like that, and he came up, and like wiped it across my shirt, and I don't know what the hell it was, but it was just like natural reaction, like I reached up, and smacked the hell out of him. Like, it was just, like, it was just natural reaction. Like, I just reached up and smacked the hell out of him right across his face. And that was it. That was, that was the extent of the entire altercation. And I remember the bus driver was looking at us through her, like, her, her little, you know, you know, like, you guys ever been on a bus? Rear view mirror. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Like, she was looking through that, and she, I could tell from the look on her face, she was waiting for something to, like, happen to see if she had to get up or something. If she, she had to handle some business or something like that. Why are we battling level 8s? What the hell? I trained for fucking Roxanne. We're battling level 8s. This is so stupid. But, uh, but yeah, I was waiting on that, and nothing ever happened. Like, the, the homeboy went and sat down, and that was the extent of it. So, like, it wasn't even really that much of a fight. Like, it was just, I just hit a kid. I didn't, like, punch him across the jar or shit. It was just legit, like a slap, because it was just reaction. Like, I wasn't trying to, like, embarrass him or, like, knock his teeth down his throat or anything. It was just, like, real quick. Real, real fat. Real fat. It was real fast right across the face. Alright. Only you guys can prevent lost save data. So make sure you save your game whenever you can, you guys. I don't even know what fucking save file. Let's go with five. But, yeah, make sure you save your game whenever you can, you guys. Because only you can prevent lost save data. And if some shit goes down this Roxanne fight, ooh. It's a Nuzlocke. So I know I can't change anything that's going to happen, but... Let's see what happens. Oh my god! Hello! <laughs> I'm Roxanne, the Rust Burrow Pokemon Gym Leader! I became Gym Leader so that I might apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in, like, battle! Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle with which Pokemon? Let's get this over with so I can go watch Keeping Up with the Kardashians over on the Eden Arc! Okay, let's stop that. <laughs> okay, so she's leaning with her Geodude, so we're not super overleveled. We're overleveled a bit, but we're not super overleveled, so hopefully we can outspeed, but I don't think we have Intimidate! Oh, oh, oh! I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Go for the bubble, bitch. Go for the bubble. Pop, 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 pop. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. This is what I was worried about, or this is what I wanted to do, actually. So I'm kind of glad we caught that. I just hope Masquerade learns some more moves as it levels up. I gotta look into that. And it's not just, uh, like you have to teach Surskit all the moves until it levels up. Well, no, it's gotta learn moves when it levels up, because Surskit evolves, like, what, like, level 21 or some shit? Wow. Alright, so level 12. Let's go. Bubble. Pop, 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 pop. 
Roxanne, you suck! You're getting wrecked by the weakest water move, yo! What does Bubble do? Like 15 damage? It's ludicrous. And last but not least, here comes the nose pass. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Come on. Come on, Mr. Nose Pass. Bubble. Bubble! Can we wreck him? Can we wreck him? Can we wreck him? Oh, he took the hit. Please don't rock tune. Rock tune, rock tune, rock tune. I don't know why that came into my head the last second. No! Oh! I knew that was going to happen. 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 Why did I leave Ohos in? Ohos had such a short run in the LP. Oh hoes! <laughs> oh god, I knew that was gonna happen. Okay, Megatron. Come on out, buddy. You got this, son. Take down. No, you can't miss! You can't miss! We should, we should, we should take that. Oh, wow. Doesn't it lower speed, though, or some shit? Ah! Oh my god, that doesn't do anything. Wow! Wow, this is gonna be such a stall fight. Oh god, this is gonna be such a stall fight. Okay, I'm gonna speed this up just a little bit. Since we're gonna sit here and just headbutt each other back and forth. Ain't nobody trying to escape! Ain't nobody trying to escape, I'm trying to fuck you up, nigga! I'm trying to fuck you up! <sighs> Megatron. Orenberry. Nigga, who rocks Orenberries? Who rocks Orenberries? Oh yeah! I rock Orenberries! <laughs> okay, anyways, let me finish my story. Um, yeah, it wasn't even really that much of a fight, it was just a slap across the face, and that was it. Like, uh, I didn't talk to the kid for the rest of the year, we kind of just went our own separate ways. Not that we were, like, super buddy-buddy to begin with or anything like that, but... Uh, I don't know, like, I've always been that kid, uh, throughout high school that's just kind of always been cool with everybody. Like, uh, like, I didn't talk to everybody, because, personally, I believe, I believe... If you meet somebody and they say, legit, that they just want to be friends with everybody, and they want to be cool with everybody, you're talking to a liar. Because the only way that you can be cool with everybody is if you tell Joey one thing and then you tell David something else. I didn't mean to use those names as, as an example, but that's basically what that's basically what happens. You cannot be cool with everybody because eventually your friends are going to end up beefing. Or people that you say are your friends are going to end up beefing. And then it's like, sure you can play the neutral party if you really wanted to, but eventually you're going to get put in that situation where... Not, not that you have to take sides, but it's like... You're, you guys get what I'm talking about? Like, eventually you're gonna have to lie about something. So, to me, whenever I hear someone say, Oh yeah, I'm friends with everybody, like, it's not true. But, uh, when I say I was cool with everybody back then, it was, I was just one of those kids that... Oh god, oh god, please don't struggle, please don't struggle, please don't struggle. Oh, damn it, damn it, I was fucking speeding through. No, 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 Megatron, 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 stop. Slow your roll, slow your roll, Megatron, slow your roll. I can't be switched out because of block. Wow, is this really about to happen? We got an ether. We have to use ether on the first fucking battle! <sighs> so good. But yeah, um, I was the, the kid that was just, I never really caused a whole lot of trouble. I never really talked shit about anybody. Uh, I kind of just did my thing throughout school, so I never really, like, caught a lot of heat. Like, I, I had friends that fought, and I had, uh, people around me that, that fought and whatnot. But like I said, I just played that neutral party, and... There was always that group of people I just never really talked to, so it was just it was just whatever. I feel like this is all just a jumbled mess, but you guys get the point that I'm making was that after that one altercation, I never really did shit with anybody. It was just kind of whatever. And oh my god, are you kidding me? Can we please get the kill here? Wow, 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 wow. Thank you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. So yeah, so I guess if you want to call that a fight, you can call it a fight. I just call it like a, a, a scuffle, an altercation. And that was legit all that really happened. That was all that really went down. We didn't... It was just it was just whatever. I don't know. I don't know what else you call it. Give me that stone badge, nigga. Give me that stone badge, nigga. Like, the stone badge heightens the attack power of your Pokemon. It also enables them to use the HM move cut outside of battle. Please take this with you, too. Team 39. Give me that rock tune, nigga. Give me that rock tune. 
That technical machine, our TM39, contains like a rock tomb. It only inflicts damage by dropping rocks. It also lowers speed. If you use a TM, it instantly teaches the move to a Pokemon. Remember, a TM can only be used once, so like, think before you use it. Okay, go watch Keeping Up with the Kardashians. We're good. So unfortunately, we lost Ohos. Oh god. Oh god. Get out of the way! Out of the way! Here comes Slowpoke. Wait, please don't take my goods. Nigga, I got Pokemon to attend to. So I need your ass to wait. Wait a minute, just wait a minute. And apparently, you guys, it, it looks like the character has white hair in this game. Apparently, it's a hat. Like, his hair's not actually white. But unfortunately, we have to. We have to do this. Episode number three. Unfortunately, you guys... Give me that item bag. Give me that fucking Warrenberry, bitch. Unfortunately, our highest level Pokemon, Ohos, is our first death of the series. I knew going into that that was risky. I just didn't think she would go for the Rock Tomb right off the bat and smash me. Because, I mean, it's not like we're playing a Dreyano hack. You know, it's the fucking computer. They're stupid. So stupid. So, yeah, unfortunately, Ohos is dead, and she now goes into the death box. That's sad. I really liked Ohos. I don't know why. In the short time that we had her, I really liked her. But, yeah, so Ohos is there. So, I guess that just leaves more room for us to go catch more Pokemon. And it's kind of ironic, because now we're just left with the two pseudos. So, it's just kind of like, uh, whatever. Whatever, you. Oh, it's you! You're that fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalburg Woods! Help me! I've been robbed by Team Aqua! I had to get the Devon Goods back! If I don't, oh, I'm gonna be in serious trouble! Alright, before I do that, nigga, let's go ahead up here to Route 115. And, uh, let's see if we can- can we catch Pokemon up here? Do I have to have- I have to have a fucking rod. Fuck, we don't have a rod yet. We don't have a rod yet, so no catching of the Pokemon on Route 115. Fine, 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 fine. Route 116, though, that's a whole other story, nigga. Can we get a good Pokemon? Give us a good Pokemon. Give us a good Pokemon. Big money, no whammy. Big money, no whammy. Big money, no whammy. It's a Murkrow. <sighs> that is not what I'd call a good Pokemon, quote unquote. Murkrow is decent. Don't get me wrong, I'm not saying that it's bad. But. Without the ability to get Honchkrow, I'm really not all too hyped about Murkrow, so... Yeah. And I can't do shit because the po fucking Pokemon won't stay in the goddamn Pokeball. Like, for real, dude. Premier Ball. What do you want from me? Premier Ball. Can I... Can I... Let's go for this. Oh my god! Wow, 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 wow. Wait, he's all those fucking Pokeballs. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, so we got Murkrow the Dark in this Pokemon. Murkrow would fear it as the alleged bearers of ill fortune. It shows strong interest in anything that sparkles. It would even try to steal rings from women. Ooh. Sneaky bitch. Sneaky bitch. So I guess that's what we're gonna call it. Let's call it Sneaky Bitch. Because why not? Will it fit? I don't think Sneaky Bitch will fit. Should we call it Sneaky? Because that's what it is. Sneaky bitch. Let's call it Sneaky. Sneaky the Murkrow. Oh shit, there's no C in Sneaky. S-N-E-A-K-Y. Sneaky the Murkrow. Okay, so I guess we'll, we'll chill with Sneaky on the team for now. I mean, we lost Ohos. I'd rather have Ohos than Sneaky, but... Oh well. Using Rage on a Wurmple. Fucking A. Shit! Ah, shit! And you guys want to know something that's really, really weird? Um, you guys have been showing outrageous, tremendous, fucking, titty crazy support. Yes, hashtag that shit. Hashtag titty crazy. Uh, you guys have been showing an insane amount of support over the first two episodes, but YouTube is not trying to let me see it. They update some metrics of the videos, but like if you go back and look at episode one. It has not updated the views for it yet. And I'm like, what is this nonsense? It is ludicrous. Um, I think that was the day that YouTube was in like read-only mode or some shit. And they were fucking around with a lot of stuff. No effects support, thank you. They were fucking around with a lot of stuff. And it was just it was just weird. The whole day. 
and for the longest time the video was just view cap 301 and it would not update and I'm just like come on man come on man what are you doing to me what are you doing to me but um, certain metrics have updated and uh, I feel like I'm gonna say this every single episode just because like I legit mean it but thank you guys thank you every time we start a new series we just go above and beyond what we did before and that's just mind numbingly awesome that's so fucking awesome so thank you guys for the support on that God, get out of here! Both of you are scrubs! Scrub a dub dub dubs! You'll rock me hard? I don't even think so, man! I don't even think so! Did Soul use his berry? Did he use that berry already? I wonder. I wonder if he did. Well, we're fighting level 8, so it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter, man! It doesn't even matter. Oh, ha! What's going on? I was digging in the tunnel without any tools when some goon ordered me out! The tunnel's full of Pokemon that react badly to loud noises. They cause an uproar. That's why we stopped using heavy equipment for tunneling. I'm worried that the goon will do something stupid and start the Pokemon into an uproar. Well, let's go fuck him up, yo. Because that's what we do, nigga. That's what we do, nigga. What's the point in this? To show me that the black glasses are over there? See? That's what I'm talking about. The stupidest shit. The stupidest shit you remember. Oh, what am I to do? We all all walk, Pico and I, when we were jumped by an old thug. The scoundrel made off with my darling, Pico. Oh, Pico! Let's go get Pico back. Pico, nigga. Rust Turf Tunnel. We have a chance to catch a new Pokemon here. Oh, it's a Rayquaza! Oh! <laughs> How mad would people be? How mad would people be if I had two pseudo legends and a legend on my team? Should I even try? Is it even worth it? It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. I know some LPers go with the idea of like legends don't count, but it's whatever. I'm, I'm not too worried about it. It's just Rust Turf Tunnel. What? Are you coming? Come and get some then. Nigga, you didn't go anywhere. You went back one step. Let's go. Gyalodon! That hostage Pokemon turned out to be worthless! And to think I made a getaway in this tunnel to nowhere! Hey, you, so you wanna battle me? I already battled you, chump. And I whooped that ass. Said I whooped that ass. Said I whooped that ass. Said I, uh, said I, uh, said I whooped that ass. You still got this whack ass Poochina. Nigga. Nigga. And what? Ah, I get wrecked. Okay. So, I don't know if we're gonna need to do any grinding. For the, for the next gym, I gotta look up Brawly's levels. Because I wanna be over level, because I wanna be able to complain. Ah! My career in crime comes to a dead end! Yeah, nigga, you suck. This is the play not right! The boss told me this would be a slick and easy job to pull! All I had to do was steal some package from Devin! <laughs> you wanna pack that badly? Take it! Give me the Devin goods, nigga. Give them to me. Hey, you ain't got shove, bitches. Shit. I ain't do shit to you. Oh, Pico! Am I glad to see you're safe? Pico owes a life to you! They call me Mr. Sobriny, and you are... Yeah, yeah, da, da, da. Ah! So you're Nappy! I sincerely thank you! Now, if there's anything that troubles you, don't hesitate to tell me! You can usually find me in my cottage by the sea near Battleburg Woods. Come, Pico. We should make our way home. Yeah, get the fuck out of here, Pico. Ain't nobody... Ain't nobody... Give a shit about you. Alright, so let's get the fuck up out of here and head back to the, uh, oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh, how did it go? The Devin Goods, you did! You got them back! You really are a great trainer! I know! As my thanks, I'll give you another great ball! Yeah, give me that great ball, nigga. Excuse me, please, come with me! This is the Devon Corporation third floor. Our president's office is on this floor. Anyways, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. Um, by the way, that parcel you got back for us, could I get you to deliver that to the shipyard in Slateport? It'd be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. Oh, <laughs> so, uh, can I count on you to do that for me? Oh, that's right. Could you wait here a second? I don't remember if this is where you get the experience share now, or do you have to get it after you deliver the package? I think it's after you deliver the package. Our president would like to have a word with you. Please come with me. I'm sure he would. What's up, old man? Please, go ahead. I'm Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation. I just got word about you. You saved our staff, not once, but twice. I have a huge... I have a favor to ask of an amazing person like you. I understand that you're delivering a package to Slateboard Shipyard. Oh, hold on, let me put my teeth back in. Well, all the way, could you stop off in Duford Town? I was hoping that you'd deliver a letter to Stephen in Duford. Yeah, give me the letter. I'll just do everything for you. You ain't even paying me, nigga. 
Now, you should know that I'm a great president, so I'd never be so cheap as to ask a favor for nothing in return. That's why I want you to have this. Pokenab, I don't want that. I want an experience share, bitch. That device is a Pokemon Navigator, or a Pokenab for short. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. It has a map of the Hoenn region. You can check the locations of Dewford and Slateport easily. By the way, I heard that the sinister criminals Magma and Aqua, I believe, have been making trouble far and wide. I think it would be best if you arrested up before you go on your way. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you, nigga. Thank you. Well then, Navi, go with caution and care. Alright, we out this bitch, nigga. We out this bitch. We out this. Actually, can we sit? Oh, nigga, sorry, X and Y was hype. Look at that shit. Anyways, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and wrap this episode up right here. Yes, I say right here in the do for president's office, because you know we do it like that, nigga. We do it like that. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna wrap this episode up right here. In the next episode, I guess, we're gonna make our way down to Dufort Town and hopefully to Slayport City if we have enough time. But. We lost one team member today, unfortunately. That was risky, and I paid the price for it, but still. We lost one team member today. Hopefully, we won't lose any more anytime soon. I'm going to look up Brawly's levels to make sure we're not too over-leveled for him. If I do any sort of training at all, it might just be for Sneaky, and that'll be about it. Uh, not for Soul or Megatron. But yeah, besides that, you guys, share with us uh, your first fight. Uh, and some of you guys, if you've had a very... Uh, What's the words I'm looking for here? I don't even know. If you've had more than one fight, share that with us too. Because <laughs> I know some of you guys out there are brawlers. But yeah, share with us your first fight if you can as well. And um, I think I think we should I think we should shoot 4,000 likes in every single episode. I think I think we should. I think because uh, I was talking about the support earlier and how we're stepping it up. I think we we are 45k strong now. We could do it. I got faith in y'all niggas. You can do it. So yeah, smash that like button for me if you enjoyed today's episode. And of course, people, thank you for checking out the video. That shit comes from the bottom of my heart, nigga. Bottom of my heart. So yeah, thank you for checking out the video. You know me, YouTube 9.92. I'm out.